Welcome to Eerie, the podcast that takes you on a journey through the most chilling and spine-tingling stories of true crime, paranormal phenomena, and folklore. I'm your host, Noah Croft, and I invite you to join me as we explore the darkest corners of the human psyche in the unexplained mysteries of our world. Nestled in the foothills of the Appalachian Mountains, Lake Lanier is a stunningly beautiful body of water that draws thousands of visitors every year. But beneath its shimmering surface lies a sinister past filled with tragedy, mystery, and unexplained phenomena. From the countless drownings that have occurred in its waters to the ghostly sightings and eerie sounds reported by locals, Lake Lanier is a place that has long been steeped in a sense of foreboding. But what is it about this seemingly idyllic spot that inspires such fear and unease? To truly understand the enigma that is Lake Lanier, you must delve deeper into its history. The story of this man-made lake can be tracked back to the early 20th century, when the idea of constructing a reservoir to serve the growing population of Georgia began to take shape. The need for reliable water supply, flood control, and hydroelectric power became increasingly evident as the region continued to develop. In 1946, the United States Congress approved the Rivers and Harbors Act, which authorized the construction of a dam and reservoir on the Chattahoochee River. This project would eventually lead to the creation of Lake Lanier. The U.S. Army Corps of Engineers was tasked with the monumental challenge of creating this massive reservoir. The first step involved an acquisition of more than 50,000 acres of land. This process was fraught with controversy and heartache as families who had lived in the area for generations were forced to sell their properties to the government, often for meager compensation construction of the Buford Dam, which would ultimately create the lake, commenced in 1950. Over the next five years, thousands of workers toiled on this enormous project, moving vast quantities of earth and pouring millions of cubic yards of concrete. As the dam neared completion, the engineers began the process of filling the reservoir. This involved diverting the Chattahoochee River, which would gradually cause the water level to rise. Over the course of two years, the waters of Lake Lanier slowly engulfed the landscape, submerging the land that had once been home to numerous towns, farms, and forests. The lake was officially completed in 1957, and it was named in honor of Sidney Lanier, a 19th century Georgia poet who had written extensively about the beauty of the region. In the years that followed the completion of Lake Lanier, the area began to transform. The lake's pristine waters and idyllic surroundings attracted developers who built marinas, parks, and residential communities along its shores. Today, Lake Lanier is a popular destination for locals and tourists alike who flock to the lake to enjoy its numerous recreational opportunities. 
but beneath the surface, the lake's dark history remains. The remnants of submerged towns, homes, and structures lie hidden under the water, providing an eerie backdrop. The countless stories of unexplained phenomena and tragic accidents that have come to define Lake Lanier. In many ways, the history of Lake Lanier is a tale of two worlds, one of progress and prosperity, and the other of loss and displacement. The lake's creation brought much needed resources and opportunities to the region, but it also resulted in the destruction of communities and the displacement of countless families. It's this duality that makes Lake Lanier such a fascinating, and haunting place. It's the reason why its mysteries continue to captivate the imaginations of those who dare to explore its depths. As the waters of Lake Lanier rose, they swallowed up entire towns, communities, and countless structures. Some were dismantled and moved elsewhere, but many were simply left to be submerged. These abandoned settlements and structures hidden beneath the water surface have given rise to eerie tales and legends that continue to captivate those who explore the lake's depths. Among these ghostly remnants are the ruins of a once thriving town called Oscarville. In its heyday, Oscarville was a busting community with a thriving cotton industry. The town featured a school, a church, a post office, and several businesses. But the creation of Lake Lanier brought an abrupt end to the town's prosperity. As the water levels began to rise, the residents of Oscarville were forced to abandon their homes and livelihoods. Many of the buildings were left standing, slowly disappearing beneath the waves. Today, divers who venture into the murky depths report finding remnants of the town, including foundations, walls, and even entire buildings eerily preserved under the water. Another submerged location, Looper Speedway, was once a popular racetrack that drew large crowds for thrilling car races. As the lake consumed the land, the racetrack's grandstands, concession stands, and areas were lost to the water. Now, a dive beneath the surface reveals the ghostly remains of the racetrack, and asphalt lanes and deteriorating structures providing an unsettling glimpse into a bygone era. It's not just entire towns that have been swallowed up by Lake Lanier. Isolated structures and landmarks have also met their watery demise. One such example is the Old Lanier Bridge, which once spanned the Chattahoochee River. When the lake was formed, the bridge was submerged and it now lies beneath the waves, its rusted metal frame providing another eerie reminder of the human history that lies beneath the water's surface. Some of the submerged structures have proven to be deadly. In 2011, a young woman named Kelly Nash disappeared while swimming near a notorious area of the lake known as Cocktail Cove. Her body was found months later entangled in the submerged branches of a tree. This tragic incident only served to fuel the fears and rumors that surrounded Lake Lanier's submerged structures. While the tales of ghost towns and submerged structures are undeniably intriguing, they also serve as a haunting reminder of the lives that were forever changed by the creation of Lake Lanier. These eerie underwater relics tell a story of lost communities, livelihoods, and a time long gone, adding to the chilling allure of this mysterious lake. Lake Lanier's tragic history doesn't end with the submerged towns and structures. Over the years, the lake has gained a chilling reputation 
due to an unnervingly high number of deaths and accidents that have occurred within its waters. While some of these incidents can be attributed to human error or natural causes, others defy explanation, leaving a lingering sense of unease and mystery. Since the lake's creation, over 200 people have lost their lives in its waters, and countless others have been injured or involved in near fatal accidents. The death toll continues to rise each year, with drowning being the most common cause of death. But what sets Lake Lanier apart from other bodies of water is the sheer number of unexplained and seemingly inexplicable fatalities. One such incident occurred in 2012, when two boats collided, resulting in the deaths of three people. The cause of the accident remains a mystery, as both boats were reportedly in good working order, and the weather conditions were clear. In another baffling case, a man named Kevin Hutchison vanished while swimming in the lake in 2016. His body was eventually found, but the circumstances surrounding his death remain unexplained. In addition to the mysterious accidents, Lake Lanier has also been the site of numerous tragic drownings. In some cases, the victims were strong swimmers or were wearing life jackets, leading to questions about what could have caused them to perish in the lake's waters. There have been instances where the bodies of victims have not been recovered for weeks, months, or even years, adding to the sense of unease that surrounds the lake. Some have speculated that the unnerving death toll at Lake Lanier may be linked to submerged structures and towns that lie beneath its surface. It's not uncommon for divers to become entangled in submerged trees or debris like we talked about before. And this has been cited as a potential cause of some of the unexplained drownings. Additionally, the lake's underwater terrain is deceptively treacherous with sudden drop-offs and strong currents that can catch even the most experienced swimmers off guard. Others believe that the lake's dark past may have imbued it with malevolent energy, leading to the numerous accidents and fatalities. Local legends and folklore often speak of vengeful spirits or curses, suggesting that the displaced souls of those who were forced to leave their homes and communities behind may still be haunting the waters of Lake Lanier. Whatever the cause of the unnerving death toll at Lake Lanier serves as a stark reminder of the dangers that can lurk beneath the water's surface. It's a chilling aspect of the lake's history that continues to haunt those who venture into its depths and leaves a lingering sense of unease in the minds of those who attempt to unravel its mysteries. Beyond the unnerving death toll, Lake Lanier has also become infamous for its share of unexplained phenomena. Reports of vanishing boats, ghostly sightings, and strange occurrences have become a staple of local folklore, adding to the lake's reputation as a place where the lines between the natural and supernatural seem to blur. One of the most persistent and chilling legends surrounding Lake Lanier involves the phenomenon of disappearing boats. Over the years, numerous boaters have reported encountering sudden and inexplicable fog that envelops their vessels only to find themselves disoriented and miles from their original location when the fog lifts. In some cases, the boats have completely vanished without a trace, leaving behind only their baffled and frightened passengers. One particularly harrowing account 
involves a group of friends who were enjoying a day on the lake when they were suddenly engulfed by a thick fog. Unable to see more than a few feet in any direction, they decided to drop anchor and wait for the fog to clear. After what felt like hours, the fog finally lifted, revealing that their boat had somehow been transported to the opposite side of the lake. To this day, they have no explanation for how they traveled such a vast distance in a short period of time. In addition to vanishing boats, Lake Lanier has also been the site of numerous ghostly sightings and encounters. One of the most famous of these involves a mysterious woman dressed in a blue evening gown. The ethereal figure has been seen wandering the shores of the lake, her pale face streaked with tears. Some believe that she is the spirit of a young woman named Delia Parker Young who drowned in the lake in the 1950s after a boating accident. Her body was not recovered until nearly two years later, and she was reportedly wearing a blue dress when she was found. Another ghostly legend involves an aberration of a man who is often seen near the old Lanier Bridge. This spectral figure dressed in old-fashioned clothing has been known to beckon to passers-by, only to vanish when they approach. Some speculate that he may be the spirit of a worker who died during the construction of the Buford Dam, or perhaps a long-lost resident of one of the submerged towns. There have also been reports of strange, unexplained noises emanating from beneath the lake surface. Divers and boaters have described hearing eerie music, disembodied voices, and even the distant sounds of submerged church bells tolling. These auditory phenomena have led some to believe that the spirits of the lake's watery graveyards may be attempting to make their presence known. Whether these unexplained phenomena can be attributed to the supernatural forces or simply the results of overactive imaginations, there's no denying that they have become an indelible part of Mike Lanier's eerie mystique. The tales of vanishing boats, ghostly apparitions, and other strange occurrences serve as a chilling reminder that there is much we still don't know or understand about this enigmatic body of water and its haunting history. As we delve deeper into the mysteries and legends surrounding Lake Lanier, it's crucial to take a closer look at the ecological impact this vast reservoir has had on the region. The creation of Lake Lanier was a transformative event both benefiting and challenging the natural environment in significant ways. One of the most significant positive ecological aspects of Lake Lanier has been the creation of a diverse and thriving habitat for numerous plant and animal species. The countless coves, inlets, and islands that dot the lake's surface provide a rich, varied environment for aquatic and terrestrial life. Fish species such as largemouth bass, crappie, and catfish are plentiful, making the lake a popular destination for anglers seeking a bountiful catch. Additionally, the lake and its shoreline support a multitude of bird species, including various waterfowl like herons, egrets, and ospreys, which thrive in the wetland areas. Mammals such as deer, raccoons, and foxes can also be found along the lake shores. Drawn to the abundant food sources, diverse habitats the reservoir provides. However, the creation of Lake Lanier has also had its share of negative ecological consequences. The flooding of the landscape resulted in a loss of vast tracts of forest, which not only disrupted the habitats 
of countless plant and animal species, but also contributed to increased erosion and sedimentation in the lake. This, in turn, has led to reduced water clarity and quality, which can affect the health of the lake's ecosystems. The damming of the Chattahoochee River has also had far-reaching effects on downstream ecosystems. The altered water flow and temperature have impacted native fish populations, particularly cold water species like trout, which depend on cooler, well-oxygenated waters for survival. Changes in the river's natural flow patterns have also affected floodplain habitats and the species that rely on them, as well as the overall health and vitality of the river itself. The introduction of invasive species has been another significant concern for Lake Lanier. Non-native species such as the zebra mussel, hydrilla, and snakehead fish have found their way into the lake's waters, often with devastating consequences for native species. These invasive species can outcompete native fauna for resources, leading to a decline in biodiversity and overall weakening of the ecosystem. Efforts to control invasive species have been met with varying degrees of success. For example, the introduction of grass carp has helped to control the spread of hydrilla, an invasive aquatic plant. However, these carp can also consume native vegetation, leading to unintended consequences, again, for the lake's ecosystem. Furthermore, the presence of invasive species in Lake Lanier has implications beyond the immediate environment. Boats and other watercraft traveling between bodies of water can inadvertently transport invasive species to other lakes and rivers, leading to a cascading effect on ecosystems throughout the region. In conclusion, the ecological impact of Lake Lanier is a complex and multifaceted issue. The creation of this massive reservoir has provided valuable habitat for a diverse array of species and contributed to the region's recreational opportunities. However, the challenges posed by habitat loss, altered water flow, and invasive species must not be overlooked. It is essential that we continue to study and understand the delicate balance of Lake Lanier's ecosystems and work to preserve and protect them for future generations. Despite its stark history and ecological challenges, Lake Lanier remains a beloved destination for those seeking recreation, sports, and leisure activities. The lake's vast expanse of water, combined with its picturesque scenery, provides a diverse array of opportunities for visitors to enjoy the outdoors and engage in various pursuits Boating is one of the most popular activities on Lake Lanier, with countless marinas and boat ramps scattered along the shoreline. Sailboats, powerboats, and personal watercraft such as jet skis can all be found traversing the lake's waters, providing a lively atmosphere for those who enjoy life on the water. The lake also offers numerous opportunities for canoeing and kayaking, with calmer inlets and coves providing the perfect setting for a serene paddle. Fishing is another popular pastime at Lake Lanier, attracting anglers from near and far. The diverse fish populations, including largemouth bass, crappie, and catfish offer a rewarding and exciting experience for both novice and experienced fishermen. Several fishing tournaments are held throughout the year drawing competitors from across the region and beyond. For those seeking to cool off during the hot Georgia summers, Lake Lanier offers numerous swimming areas, both public and private, along its shores. Sandy beaches such as those found at Lake Lanier's Island Resort and Buford Dam Park provide the perfect place to relax and soak up the sun while enjoying the refreshing waters of the lake. Water sports enthusiasts will find plenty to keep them occupied at Lake Lanier as well. Activities such as wakeboarding, 
Water skiing and tubing are popular choices, providing thrilling experiences for participants and spectators alike. The lake's calm waters and warm temperatures create ideal conditions for these sports, ensuring a fun day on the water. Hikers and nature lovers will also find much to enjoy at Lake Lanier, with numerous parks and recreation areas surrounding the lake, trails such as the Laurel Ridge Trail and the Sawney Mountain Preserve Trail offer stunning vistas of the lake and its surrounding landscape, as well as opportunities to spot local wildlife. The area's diverse plant life and wooded areas provide a lush, verdant backdrop for leisurely strolls and more challenging hikes. For those who prefer a more relaxing experience, Lake Lanier is home to several campgrounds and vacation rentals, allowing visitors to immerse themselves in the beauty of the Georgia wilderness. Whether you prefer the rustic charm of a tent or the comforts of a lakeside cabin, there are accommodations to suit every taste and preference. Finally, Lake Lanier also hosts numerous events and festivals throughout the year, such as the annual lights on the lake holiday, light display the Independence Day celebration, and various concerts and music festivals. These events draw visitors from all over, making Lake Lanier a hub of activity and excitement year-round. As we've journeyed through the history, ecological impact, and recreational opportunities at Lake Lanier, it's clear that this unique reservoir has captured the imaginations and hearts of countless people over time, a rich tapestry of folklore and urban legends has emerged, adding a sense of mystique and wonder to the lake's already intriguing story. An eerie tale surrounding Lake Lanier involves a mysterious island, sometimes referred to as Ghost Island or the Drowning Island. Stories have circulated for years about a small island where several people have allegedly drowned under mysterious circumstances. Some say that the island is cursed, while others speculate that there are hidden underwater hazards responsible for the accidents. Regardless of the cause, the island has become a magnet for thrill-seekers and paranormal enthusiasts alike. Whisperings of ghost towns and submerged structures beneath the lake's surface have also fueled the imaginations of those drawn to Lake Lanier's darker side. These stories, which we discussed earlier, lend a haunting quality to the lake, as people imagine entire communities lying hidden beneath the water, forever lost to time. In addition to these legends, numerous reports of inexplicable occurrences and strange sightings have emerged over the years. Some claim to have seen ghostly apparitions on the lake shores or heard the disembodied laughter of children echoing across the water. Others report feeling an unexplained chill or sense of unease while boating or swimming in the lake, as if unseen forces are watching from the depths below. While Lake Lanier is known for its dark history and eerie legends, there's another tale that's been circulating for years. The legendary catfish that call the lake home. Some locals claim that there are catfish in the lake that are so big they can swallow a person whole. These catfish are said to be the size of a Volkswagen and have been spotted by fishermen and boaters alike. The stories of these giant catfish have become so pervasive that they've even been featured on popular television shows like River Monsters. But how much truth is there to these stories? According to the Georgia Department of Natural Resources, there are indeed catfish in Lake Lanier, but they're not quite as monstrous as some might believe. The largest catfish caught in the lake to date was a 97 pound blue catfish in 2010. While that's certainly an impressive catch, it's a far cry from an alleged Volkswagen sized catfish that have been rumored to roam the lake. Despite this discrepancy between fact and legend, 
The tales of giant catfish continue to capture the imagination of those who visit the lake. And who knows, maybe someday someone will catch the elusive catfish that's been rumored to dwell in the lake's depths. While it's difficult to separate fact from fiction when it comes to folklore and urban legends, there's no denying the captivating allure of Lake Lanier's mysterious tales. These stories have become an integral part of the lake's cultural fabric, captivating visitors and residents alike with their eerie, enigmatic charm. Whether these legends are fact or fiction, they serve as a reminder of the lake's rich history, its secrets, and the many unanswered questions that still linger beneath. Whether you are drawn to its history, recreational opportunities, or mysterious legends, Lake Lanier will continue to capture the imagination and inspire curiosity. As we conclude our journey, it's essential to remember that the story of Lake Lanier is still being written. The ongoing efforts of local organizations and communities to protect and preserve the lake, its ecosystems, and its resources ensure that this incredible reservoir will remain a source of fascination, beauty, and inspiration for years to come. There's no denying the power of this unique body of water. As we part ways, I invite you to continue exploring the many stories and secrets that lie beneath the surface and embrace the sense of wonder and curiosity that this remarkable place inspires. Thank you for joining us on this exploration of Lake Lanier. We hope you found it as fascinating and as captivating as I did. Don't forget to follow us on social media at EriePod for more spooky content and updates. If you have any weird stories or recommendations, feel free to email us at info at the eriepodcast.com. Join us next week as we delve into the story of the Andes plane crash survivors, a tale of resilience, tragedy, and the human spirit. Until then, stay eerie and keep exploring the mysteries of the world.